Up next, no stranger to live it up, it is Craig Weintraub, and you brought wonderful Angelo. How are you guys? Good? Good. We're great. Good. Great. Thank you for having us. So we're here today to talk about the Long Beach International Film Festival and their connection with the wonderful Madison Theater at Montboy yeah. College, and in particular, Oscar night? Yeah, I mean, we could not have a better partnership than we have with Angelo Fabroni and and Beth over at Madison Theater at Malloy College. We've had the festival there uh, for several years now, and this is going to be year two that we're having our um, our Oscar screening event. And this year we, we've included a Taste of the Oscars to start it off and to kick it off. Everybody wants a full belly before you're going to watch it. And there are a dozen restaurants and wine companies, beer companies, liquor companies. Red Door Spa will be there on the red carpet primping, uh, getting the hair right and the makeup right and the vibes right. So when you walk it, you'll look like a celebrity. And it's just a great, fun night. Last year was great. This year is going to be even better. And the restaurants even have a couple of celebrity chefs. I mean, this is a big, big night. Absolutely. Bigger and better than ever. Absolutely. We, we try to make it as fun as possible. It's, it's, it's a night out. It's girls' night out. It's whatever. It, it's not... It's not supposed to be stuffy. We just want people to celebrate and have fun and enjoy the night. So we try to make it like Hollywood so they can walk the red carpet. They can buy a star if they want. We can line, we line the red carpet with Hollywood stars. Um, it, we just make it fun. And the restaurants and, the, and our partners in the, in the community from Long Beach to Rockville Center, they're really contributing a lot too, you know, and they're having fun with us. They're gonna, we're serving desserts on stage, you know, coffee on stage, but the dinner's outside, and it, it's going to be an exciting evening. It's a lot of fun. And the screen is gigantic. As artistic director, you probably know the dimensions. How big is that screen? Well, we have we have two screens. We're using the large one. Uh, I think it's. 36 by 24. It's um, gigantic. It's huge. We're going to actually have to pare it down because when you're sitting on stage, right. we have VIP seats where you get lounge seats on the stage. If it gets too big, you know, you, you're basically, you feel like you're in a, um, one of those uh, odium cineplex yeah. type <laughs> theaters, but it's, it's a lot of fun. It's well, a great stage. I was there last year. I was sitting on, on the stage and I loved it because you really, I mean, we were actually you feel so engaged when you're watching it at the theater because you're actually like applauding as if you're part of the real audience. It's so much fun. Yeah, I mean, it's uh, it's great just to even be able to watch the Oscars like that. But in an, uh, that aside, we're, we're going to have Paul Bond, who's a great comedian there, entertaining the, the audience and the crowd beforehand and during the Oscars telecast. And then, uh, the and yeah, the commercials. And then we also have a very, very important part where we're honoring uh, Burt Young, and uh, yeah, Angela can tell you all about the scholarship that's in Bert's name. Yeah, you know, he's fabulous. So, so thank you for for having him join you know join us here at Live It Up. It's so wonderful to talk to him, and it, he was so honored and touched by this scholarship. What will this scholarship do? It's for uh, underserved it's children, underserved underprivileged children. Okay. Um, you know, our summer program it's intensive. So we have you know musical theater intensive. We have a film intensive. But a lot of the underserved people can't afford it. You know, it's just too pricey for them. And so we thought, well, how can we engage them without giving, without us losing too much money? You know, because we still have to pay all our um, educators and teachers and stuff, and our, our celebrities that come in to work with the kids. Uh, we felt we had to form some sort of a scholarship. Now, when I approached Ingrid and Craig with this, they had already sort of done this. Um, the Long Beach Film Festival already started this in their own community. And they thought this would be a great extension. And so, we again, we partnered not only with the Film Festival, but we wanted to do little events throughout the year so people um, realize that what we're doing in the community, along with the Long Beach International Film Festival, that we're actually giving back to the community, and especially to underserved pe people, so they can get an education or they can actually get exposed to uh, different technologies and stuff that they normally wouldn't have the chance to um, to be exposed to unless they did it in their high school, which is very limited or you know after they've graduated so we're trying to you know ignite ignite someone's interest in film it's in beautiful filmmaking. and you even had uh graduates of the first summer camp at the long beach international film festival yeah, they no, were doing they were taking part in all of that so let's talk about that real connection it's it's full circle yeah i mean it's having the festival there's so many different facets to it and and you know, whether it's planning for the festival itself and you're working with filmmakers or during the actual event where they, the students can actually network with real filmmakers who have their films in our festival, um, it's, a, it's, a, it's an opportunity that they don't normally get, especially here on Long Island. So uh, to be able to get the education that they wouldn't normally be able to get, be able to come and rub elbows with people who are actually doing it and they can actually learn from even more, uh, it's, it's such a great opportunity that's really priceless. So the Oscar night is? 
It's February the 28th. Okay. Uh, 5.30 to 7.30, we'll have the Taste of the Oscars. Uh, at 7.30, we'll be honoring uh, the Burt, uh, Burt Young for the scholarship. And, uh, and then at 8 o'clock is when uh, the live feed from Hollywood comes our way and uh, Paul Bond takes the stage and we, uh, we have a great night. And let the magic begin. Yeah. We have games and stuff that people can participate in, so it's a lot of fun. I can't wait. I, I, I'm going to go shopping right after this because now I'm so excited. I'm like, what to wear? What to yeah. wear, right? So thank you so much, and uh, congratulations to you and all that you're creating. Uh, a big shout-out and thank you to all of the sponsors. So for information, where can they go? Uh, they can go to a Madison Theatre website. They can go to Long Beach International Film uh, Festival website. Uh, my associate, Beth Carote, actually knows more about this and I, she actually works with Ingrid very hard on this. Great. Uh, she, you know, you can call and, okay. and Beth can give her, give them the information over the phone. So Fantastic. Yeah. So uh, thank you so much. Can't wait. I'll thank be, so I'll much. be there. Uh, please join us. We would uh, love to have you there. And if you are watching in another part of the country, maybe this will inspire you uh, to take some action and collaborate with your teammates to make a difference uh, by having something similar in your town. Thanks for watching. Live it up.